Greetings everyone, this is Danny from hardtravel.com, your luxury all-inclusive experts, and today I'm at one of my favorite places in the entire planet, the LeBlanc Spa Resort Los Cabos. My wife and I love to get away here. It's an adults-only resort, and in my book, they get just about everything perfect. The food is out of this world. They have a huge spa, including an amazing complimentary hydrotherapy feature. The pools are out of this world. Of course, we're right on the beach, but as we walk through the resort, you're gonna see exactly what I'm talking about. So join me as we head on inside. As soon as you enter the magnificent lobby, you know that you are somewhere special. From the signature scent to just the giant wide open spaces, the architectural features like that incredible chandelier, the flowers, but really that view directly out to the Pacific Ocean is unbelievable. As soon as you come in the resort, they're gonna take you to one of these guest services areas, sit you down, explain the entire process, but it's not just a hotel check-in. They give you a nice warm neck pillow with aromatherapy and a nice cocktail that you can sit and relax and just get in the mood for vacation. As you continue through the lobby, you get out to the terrace. Just like in the lobby, the features are absolutely breathtaking. You've got these beautiful trees, they're wrapped in lights. And then throughout the entire terrace, which is massive, you're gonna have all kinds of different seating nooks, different places to sit and get away. During the day, they have the umbrellas up, but in the evening, this transforms into an entirely different space. They have little fire pits all spread throughout the rooftop. It's also a great place if you're hosting a reception, but what it's all about is the ocean views. The entire resort is set up in a half moon shape facing out to the ocean so that you can get that incredible, breathtaking view of the pools down below, the ocean, and just hear the sound of the waves. As an extension to the terrace, you have the west rooftop. This is another spectacular space. You see all of the landscaping is perfectly groomed, but what makes this even more unique is they have several different fire pits and nooks where you can sit in the evening. You can also tuck away there during the day, but this is the ultimate multi-function space on the property. At the very, very end, you have this beautiful arch that's framed just like the famous Cabo Arch at Land's Inn, and it's set up for everything from morning yoga to chef's dinners in the evening to even a perfect place for a wedding reception. What really makes this space special though is the incredible 270 degree views all around you. There's also another rooftop terrace on the other side, takes advantage of those same views. It's a little bit smaller and intimate and perfect for a smaller reception or a private dinner. Just below the terrace, you'll find the iconic Blanc fire. This is the place to be in the evening, either before dinner or after. Up above, you have a lounge area with some fire pits, but down below is where the full bar is. You're also gonna have day beds, different kinds of loungers, couches, a full bar, including a table seating. You have live music in the evening set up over on the stage, but really what this is about is a place to just get a cocktail and take in these iconic views. You look over the entire pool area and the Pacific Ocean is just in the distance. As you would expect with any world-class resort, LeBlanc has an amazing pool area. Directly in front of me, you're gonna have the first of four pools, and this is one of two heated pools. This is a little bit of an activity pool. Of course, at LeBlanc, everything is chill and very relaxed, but here they'll do things like floating yoga and different kinds of water exercises. But of course, my favorite part, the swim up bar. Around the pool, you're gonna find these partial shade cabanas. They're double day beds. Those are complimentary. In addition to that, they have the over-the-top South Beach style beach cabanas as well. Now these have smart TVs in them, come with a dedicated cabana attendant, and they do cost an additional charge. Along the pool, you're gonna see these plush loungers, very, very comfortable. They have towels that are on them. And of course, you have your pool concierge here. So in addition to having your butler in the rooms, you're gonna have this pool concierge. They can provide everything from sunscreen to pool toys to just a, a drink, <laughs> which is the perfect thing to have alongside the pool. Now, as we continue on, you can see the second pool. This is one of the two side colder pools. What I like is the ability to go between the two, cool off and then get back in. But where I'm gonna end up every single time is the incredible infinity edge pool right on the edge of the Pacific Ocean. In my mind, there's no better place to be on this resort or frankly anywhere in the world than with a cocktail in your hand, looking out over the ocean and an infinity edge pool. In addition to everything that the pool concierge can provide, they also have some really cool surprise and delight features like their taco truck. This is uh, El Pastor Tacos made the traditional way, which is one of my all time favorites to begin with. And in addition, they also have a guacamole truck right next door. I mean, come on, by the pool, that's a perfect thing. And to top it off, you also have an ice cream truck where you can select whatever refreshing flavors you like. 
You also have two enormous hot tubs looking out at the ocean. And then all along the infinity pool, you've got more seating, including some more private cabana options if you want to go with that upgraded route. You cannot have an incredible Infinity Edge pool like this without an absolutely amazing swim up bar. And as part of that luxury all inclusive, what I love is that they have top shelf alcohol, of course, but world class mixologists with all the different touches and accoutrements that you would want. At every single restaurant, they have their own signature cocktails and out here at the pool, it's no different. When you're down at the Infinity Edge Pool, you may be wondering what this massive beachfront villa is that's right next to it. This is actually part of the LeBlanc property. It's called The Residence, and at over 18,000 square feet, it is an amazing private space. Of course, you get everything that the resort has to offer, but we did a full video tour, and we have video tours of every single room category here at the resort, so we recommend that you check them out when you're done with the video tour. LeBlanc has a beautiful beach just out in front. It's a great place to walk, enjoy the sunrise or the sunset. They also put out loungers with shade. And it is important to note that they do have service out there. So you can get drinks, you can also get the same snacks that you can get by the pool. They leave these out later into the evening. I really did appreciate that. And they also have meals and different kinds of events that can be arranged out here on the beach itself. It is important to note that this is not a swimmable beach, just like most of Cabo San Lucas. So make sure that you stay away from the water area, but enjoy the incredible beach. Whether you're getting out of the infinity pool or coming up from the beach, you have this great outdoor shower here. I really like they even have the detail of having the foot shower there as well. So you get that sand off and head on back into the resort. Right on the ocean, you are gonna find the Blanc Ocean Restaurant. This is a casual eatery here, and it's for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. The menu, of course, changes throughout, and it's got some great seating options. You can sit out in the sun if you'd like. You got chairs and sofa loungers. You also have shade, and of course, you can sit in two seaters just by the ocean, taking in the incredible view. The food is amazing here. Breakfast, you're gonna find a mix of Mexican favorites and of course, classic American fare. For lunch, the ceviches. Oh, anyway, it was absolutely out of this world, but they have tacos and a full diverse Mexican menu. And then for dinner, it expands even more and you get that same concept. Very local, very fresh, but a fusion of Mexican and American. You can't have a great oceanfront restaurant without a fantastic oceanfront bar. The bartenders here have been amazing. In fact, they have an incredible ocean view, but you've got a nice little lounge and seating area, or you can sit at the bar in between the meals or before. Now we're inside Blanc International. This is a breakfast, lunch, and dinner venue. I had an amazing breakfast this morning. I loved all the fresh juice options. The fresh fruit was really, really delicious. And the chilaquiles were out of this world, as you would expect. But it had a pretty big Mexican menu and all of the classic American fare as well. For lunch, you're gonna have burgers and different kind of seafood options. It's not as big of a menu, but absolutely delicious. And at night, this turns into a steakhouse, and it is amazing. Well, I'm always a ribeye guy myself, but every single option that I saw looked delicious. They have a wide variety of appetizers and also some skewers, including the delicious octopus. So now we're in Blanc Pizza. This is exactly what it sounds like. It's a pizzeria. They have this really fantastic brick oven over there. The pizza was fantastic today. I really enjoyed it. The menu starts off with some great salads, you've got some great appetizers, and then pizzas throughout the day. And this also doubles as kind of a late morning into lunch venue, and later on in the evening, it expands the menu a little more. Now around the corner, you've got more seating, you've got these great benches along with the chairs looking out at the ocean. On the other side, you're gonna have the full bar, so normally they'll have the full alcohol set up there. You've got the tap, and then as you continue along, you can see more of the same seating, but what's great is this also has a fantastic outdoor space as well, the patio. Basically, you're getting a pizzeria menu, but it's elevated just like you would expect with LeBlanc. We're just inside Meze, which is a Lebanese restaurant. That's a unique thing for an all-inclusive, but they do it really, really well. What you have on the menu is a wide variety of cold and hot, like appetizers, small bites. It's Lebanese and Mediterranean whole, but you really gotta try the main course of the short rib shawarma. It's absolutely phenomenal, but once again, another fantastic meal option. One of the most surprising dining experiences I had was the incredible Blanc Italia. Now, it was a truly authentic Italian meal. I absolutely love Italian food. Been to Italy quite a few times. Now, Taylor, the man behind the camera, this was his favorite meal here by far. The gnocchi was out of this world. But in general, I just love that they've really got those traditional flavors with a little bit of Mexican flair in there as well. But if you want super traditional, you can really, truly get it here. For seating, you have tables throughout two, four, six. They even have a private room that will hold up to 10. And of course, what it's all about are the incredible views out to the ocean from here. So now we're headed into Lumiere. It is the fine dining restaurant here at LeBlanc. 
It is French inspired, of course. It's got a little bit of classic French, but also French with a modern twist. And one of the things that I love here is that they get all of the fish, of course, caught locally in the Pacific. But in addition to that, they have some great partnerships for really, really excellent high quality vegetables and fruits. And you really tell it in the fine dining menu that they have here because it's really inspired. This is always the one that we get the most incredible feedback from. They have additional indoor seating as well as a phenomenal terrace. So you can request whether you want to be indoor or out there. And in addition to that, they also have a great private room for up to 10. So once again, if you're having a wedding here or if you're doing a private event or you just want to have a large get together, that's perfect to have the privacy. As you walk into Blanc Asia, the mood is immediately set because you have this beautiful water feature, gives that little bit of moisture in the air and the Asian design all around. Now this is truly an Asian fusion restaurant. It's a mix between Japanese dishes, Chinese dishes and Thai, which what I love about that is just about everybody can find something that's perfect for them. Now they take great advantage of the seafood caught just off the coast here, had an amazing lobster, and then of course the sushi and sashimi are fantastic as you would expect. But some of the surprises were really these amazing Thai dishes or Chinese Thai fusion dishes that they had. Now the seating itself, they have a lot of bench seating that all faces out at the ocean. You've got tables, and then one really unique feature is this beautiful room for just eight to 10 people, and this is something that you wanna pre-reserve. In addition, they also have a great outdoor seating area, so you can have that indoor-outdoor feel that Cabo is known for. Just off the lobby, you have the beautiful lobby bar that services this area as well as the full terrace. You've got the beautiful glass chandeliers, and as you continue in, you can see there's a mixed eclectic furniture and space in here. You've got seats for two, large couches for small groups, and then you even have a piano over there where they'll play in the evening just to set the aesthetic. One little detail I wanted to point out is that they pay attention to everything at the bar. They even have their own fruit dehydrator there to make the, the signature drink here at the lobby bar. So now we're in the Blanc Cafe. This is the coffee shop. And one of the things I really appreciate is they keep it open late in the evening as well as early in the morning. So right here, you've got an assortment of sweets. But what's really unique about this is they have all awesome crepes. You've got both sweet and savory to choose from. They have their own waffles, make paninis. But one of the favorite things is they actually make their own waffle cones for my happy place, which is all the ice cream selections down here. Of course, being a coffee shop, they have a full range of coffees and teas. They've been really delicious our entire stay. And then to top it off, all of these incredible sweet treats to choose from. It's an awesome place to hang out and then head right on out to the outdoor terrace where you can get that beautiful ocean view. Now we're just inside the Blanc stage. This is a sports bar, evening venue, and also a wonderful place to hide out during the day and grab a quiet place to read. Beautifully decorated and appointed. You can see the stage right here in the evening. They'll have different kinds of music and acts and different uh, variety for you to choose from. And as you continue along, you can really tell that this is also a sports bar, a fantastic one. They've got TVs everywhere, a nice little private spaces tucked away so that you can watch the game and have different games on, of course, very important. And back here, you've got the full bar. It's not just one bar, you've got a bar on the other side as well. And tucked away in the corner, you do have a billiards table. So a really awesome place to watch the game, but also, like I said, to just take in the ambiance. You've got great memorabilia everywhere. And once again, a beautifully decorated space. Down on level two, you're gonna find the spa. And as you can imagine, for a resort that puts spa in its name, they take it very seriously and they do an incredible job with it. It's a huge amount of space. Right here, you've got the three check-in areas. They even have a ritual upon check-in where they bring you a small tonic. They even bring some towels, pour some hot water over it so you can be refreshed and start the experience. Before we head into the main spa area, I just wanted to point out that they do have a fish spa experience as well, where they combine that with an arm and neck massage. Your spa concierge will come out and get you and bring you back. I just wanted to point out that this is the gentleman's side, the ladies is on the other side, but it's identical in both places. As soon as you head behind the curtain, you're gonna be greeted. They'll bring you a robe. And if you follow me on in, they take you right into the locker room area. Everybody gets their own locker. And of course it's digital, have everything that you need in there. They bring you your slippers, your robe, and then head right on back to the shower area. So I'll just point to it right back there, but they do request that you have a shower before and after your spa treatments. The hydrotherapy circuit starts as soon as you get inside. Right here, you're gonna have the large sauna meant to open up your pores. And I love that they even came in and they'd spray a refreshing mist here and there to, uh, to cool you off just a little bit, but maintain the experience. As you continue on in, it's kind of a jump back and forth. So they have you go from the sauna all the way over to the ice room over here. 
And the idea behind that is the sauna opens up your pores and you take the ice, rub it all over your body, you get that little bit of a shock and it closes the pores up. And then you continue on through the circuit, you've got the fantastic steam room. Of course, we're not gonna open that up because it would fog up the lens. And then finally, you head into the experience showers. And it really was an experience. It starts at the bottom, works its way up, kind of like the car wash style, and then it goes from hot to cold. And then on the other side, you have one of the largest rainforest shower heads I've ever used. The last piece of this space are these four stone loungers. They're heated, so you can sit and relax before you head into the hydrotherapy pool. Now the part that I really love the most, and that is this massive hydrotherapy pool area. You actually work through the circuit once again. You start over with the jacuzzi tub, work into the, the bubble loungers. So this is not gonna be quite as hot as the jacuzzi. You move on over, you can do your lower back and upper back on the waterfalls. And then finally you head into the plunge pool and that is icy cold, but it was really refreshing and actually was great for my back and my knee. There's also quite a bit of seating down here so you can sit, relax, read a book, or just listen to the amazing sounds. Kind of mesmerizing with all of that behind you. And then of course your spa concierge would be happy to bring you a drink or a snack if you'd like. So just around the corner from the hydrotherapy pool, you're gonna find the relaxation area. Now, if you're going to have a spa treatment, this is where you're most likely gonna start, where you can sit, relax, and really get in that zen mindset before you have the treatment itself. They're gonna come out and get you here, but you can see that they have these great, really big loungers, and they also have these day beds that add a little bit of privacy where you can just sit, lounge, and get relaxed. So now we're in one of the single treatment rooms. This is where they're gonna do the different types of massages. One of my all-time favorites is, of course, the hot stone. But one of the things that really surprised me that I really liked here was the aromatherapy massage. They combine a little bit of stretching, a little bit of Swedish massage, and different aromatherapy and relaxation techniques. Now we're in one of the double treatment rooms. You can see, of course, with the two beds, but I wanted to point out that they have a shower over here because there's quite a few different treatment options that you can do, including one of the, my all-time favorites, which is a chocolate wrap. Just like throughout the entire resort, they really try to pay homage to the local area and also to some of the local treatments and mix them together with the most familiar that you would already know. So now we're in the VIP suite, and if you wanna be treated like a VIP, you're going to be anyways, but this just takes it to the whole nother level. I love the little touches where they even have the candles there as you step up into the jacuzzi tub. Big enough for two people, so you can have this for a single treatment or for a double couples treatment as well. As we continue along, you have everything that you would expect, but unexpectedly, you also have your own private sauna right here. You also are gonna have a private aromatherapy steam room, and then of course, a double shower. The spa also has a very high quality, full service salon. So as you come in, you can see all the Chi products. They do have a partnership with Chi. And as we continue on, here are the hair stations. So you can do pretty much any of the things you can do at a salon at home, you can do here as well. You've got the hair washing stations over there, and then the pedicures, very relaxing thing to do on vacation for sure. And then as we continue along, you have the manicure stations. Well, I really like these, they're a little bit different than what I've seen in the past, but they look really comfortable. And once again, a massage chair. Now at LeBlanc, weddings are a very, very popular thing. It, it's a beautiful place to get married for sure. And having all of these services here, in addition to the little touches, like this absolutely beautiful wedding room, bridal suite area, you can see that they've dedicated a lot of time and energy to it, and they do a fantastic job. Blanc Fitness is one of the most complete resort gyms that you will ever find, and they take care of every detail. So you've got your water, room temperature, also cold to choose from as well. You've got your lockers just inside as you walk in, the towels, and they've got a full training schedule up here on the TV. Everything from yoga to personal training, which they don't charge extra for, Zumba, dance classes, and even a session that's all in Spanish if you wanna work on your Spanish. Lots and lots to choose from, and they also carry over into the evening as they go into the Blanc stage where you can have some different dancing activities and things along those lines. So you've got a ton of cardio in here as we work through. You've got the treadmills, ellipticals, and the bikes. You've got a large section for arms, back, and legs. And as we continue along, we get to the free weights. I did want to point out that there are TVs everywhere in here, watching different kinds of sports for the most part, different things on, you can just ask for it, they're happy to change. And now we're into the free weights area. They have really, really large dumbbells, kettlebells, and then all the free weight equipment that you would imagine. And they also have a fantastic circuit. So if you like doing those circuits, you can work just about every part of your body right here. 
Now into the last part of the gym, you can see they do spinning in here. They also do yoga. TRX is all hanging up there. And they also have some of the personal training sessions in here as well. As you can see, it is a phenomenal fitness center for anywhere, but especially for a resort. So now I'm headed into the Blanc Sand Convention Center. Now, as you can imagine, a luxury all-inclusive resort like LeBlanc is perfect for incentive groups, weddings, and all kinds of different configurations for those who appreciate luxury and really want the reward that's tied to it. Now, what's great about this is they have quite a few diverse spaces here. So right here in the uh, entryway, the foyer, you can set this up for a private group check-in if you like, and then you've got the massive ballroom in front of me, but of course, it can be divided up. They've got the screens, and once again, what I love about being at a brand new resort like this is that you have all of the top-of-the-line technology and audio-visual that you always need when you're running an event. Now, as we continue along the corner, you have another huge hallway and foyer that you can have a cocktail reception in or just about any other configuration that you'd like. And also keep in mind that throughout the entire resort, there's other spaces that may be perfect for your wedding or your group, and this can just be one of the pieces of the puzzle. So here you can see one of the configurations that this ballroom can be divided up into. I love the massively high ceilings. It gives even more sense of luxury and openness. This actually can divide up one more time even, so you can have two different breakout rooms here. But the massive ballroom can have eight breakout rooms or opened all the way up and accommodate a little over 500 people. Now we're inside Blanc Business. Now this is a business center in a traditional sense. You've got computers you can use. Of course, you can come down to print things out, but it also doubles as a great meeting space and lounge area. You can set that up as a full bar area. And you also have Blanc meetings inside. So this is a small boardroom. And on the, just across, you're gonna have Blanc Board, which is a much larger, really fantastic executive boardroom. And keep in mind, all of these spaces have state-of-the-art technology, audio and visual, so you don't have to worry about that. This is the Breeze Ballroom. Wanted to point out that you enter it externally, so from the outside. It has all the audio visual that you would expect, including a huge drop-down screen there. Right now, it's one of the configurations for meetings, but it can be set up for a different variety of meetings and receptions. Thank you so much for watching with us. Congratulations for making it all the way through the video. We really appreciate it. Please make sure you hit that subscribe button, the bell for notifications, and like the video. It means the world to us. But right now, I've got some very, very important business to tend to right after we book your journey. Please keep in mind that Hard Travel has been doing this for nearly 40 years and we cannot wait to create the vacation of a lifetime for you at an incredible value. Now to my office. See you guys on the flip side. <sighs> Taylor, where's the churro cart? You promised me a churro cart. partial shade cabanas with the double day beds. Those stop, 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 stop.